I go to this party, I don't fit in. I'm not very girly. These girls, they're like size double zero. I mean, they're beautiful, but they're mean because they're hungry, you know? <laughs> Welcome back. That's comedian Tammy Pescatelli, one of the hardest working women in comedy today and now touring around the country with sold out shows. And she is back at the Pittsburgh Improv this weekend with her take on life as a wife, mother and comedian. And that was about 15 years ago. So don't adjust your set. OK, <laughs> when you see me on now old and wrinkly and I see this beautiful picture of when I was young, it's so funny when you're young, you don't realize I know. that you're young. I remember complaining about how fat my thighs were when I was in college and I'm like, if only I could have those right? thighs again. And now <laughs> everybody, you don't know what's real anyway, because half your friends take a picture and then they beauty app only it's themselves so and leave you looking like Shrek. Come on, <laughs> what happened to women's empowerment? Beauty app everybody. That's so true on right? social media. It's yeah. so ridiculous. So when people come to your show, the Pittsburgh Improv, what should they expect? Uh, expect to just enjoy yourself. But I'm not politically correct. I'm not dirty or anything like that. I don't, which camera's on? Look at me. I'm not dirty, but there are exits you can leave at any point, okay? <laughs> like, it's not hostage comedy, right? Like, I just, I'm at the stage of my life that the fact is, is that I think that the biggest problem with this country isn't politics or race or religion. Too many generations are alive at the same time. <laughs> I feel like people right? are living <laughs> longer. Yeah, some people were supposed to die. <laughs> like, you're not, I shouldn't have to entertain seven <laughs> generations in one show. We grew up differently. That, that's a lot to cover, yeah. Uh, right. I just learned that my daughter, who's five, is part of Generation Alpha. Oh. What does that mean? Well, that means they're taking over. Right? Better yeah, than apparently. Generation Beta. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> now, you were just telling us you filmed a Pittsburgh or a movie in Pittsburgh that's about to come out, right? Yeah, uh, February 13th, the premiere is at the Strand Theater. It's called That's Amore. That's so awesome. Yeah, it's about this it's just, uh, it's the first time I was ever a lead. I've been in a lot of pictures, I've been in a lot of things, but. I'm, a, I'm the daughter of an Italian mother who's a little bit overbearing and she needs to have a heart procedure and she won't do it unless I'm married. So we make a deal. Oh. And that's kind of how it goes from there. I want to see this movie. You should come, come, come cover it with Strand. me. Hang out. Yeah, I don't know if I'm exciting. any good in it though. So wait, maybe no. let me see it first. You're, and I'll you're let fantastic. You know. be fantastic in it. Yeah. Well, it's acting. I do have a mother-in-law, so I've pretended for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> well, so you also have you have so many things going on because you also have specials coming out on Amazon. You already have one on there. Another yeah. one's coming out March 17th. It's the Way After School special because everybody in my generation, that's how we learn things at the after school special yeah right of course we didn't there wasn't a heroin problem because we saw what happened to Jodie Foster on the after school mm -hmm. special mm -hmm. right so that's that's <laughs> what I went back to my old high school talk about people go huge and they go to these big arenas I went to my old high school people who knew me before puberty and did this little special there because my guidance counselor told me I couldn't be on TV and look at you oh, now wow. was it the guidance counselor there when you went back well she was dead and I oh. started to cry and they thought oh gosh we're sorry to tell you that I'm like no I was gonna tell her off but that's okay <laughs> Sorry, here's some flowers. Thank you. Is this what we got? Oh really? God. This is amazing. It's funny what motivates you sometimes, you know? Right? And you have to. Well, you I'm, compared yourself probably. I grew up with all boys. I'm yeah. like, I'm, I'm, I'm a neighborhood girl. Like, she, she said, the only way you're going to be on TV is if you rob a bank. That's what oh, she told wow. me. Jeez. Right, that was That's a harsh. misguidance counselor. Now yeah, exactly. you can't. Yeah. They did tell us that stuff. I remember my yeah. brother said he wanted to be an astronaut. My father was like, you're too stupid. So like that, it was career advice back then. I don't, you know what I mean? That's that's what they did back then. Now you right. never do it. Okay, now yes, sweetie, whatever you need. Yeah, right. And right. You're, you're a mom, I'm so a mom. you know. Do you find yourself doing that with your, your own kids? Well, I only have one that oh, I know don't. about. Um, <laughs> But you would know, I, I just, think. I know it's, it's a silly joke. It's a good joke. Um, yeah, I, I, of course, I motivate. I want him to be motivated. I want him to feel like he can take on the world. But I also want to be realistic with him. I also don't want him living in my basement playing Frogger for the rest of his life either. You know what I mean? This I said Frogger? Frogger. Do they play Frogger I, now? I just, well, they do. It's coming back. It's a retro oh, really? game. Okay, it's it's one like... of the games you can't make money off of. That's why. That's uh, okay. <laughs> All the other ones they can make money on. Well, some of your shows are already selling out, so you want to get yeah, tickets Yeah, we're sold now. out. Yeah. Um, I, and if you can't get tickets to the Improv, I'll be at the Lamp Theater here on the 
14th of February. So That's great. But we'll, I think, come see me this weekend. Awesome. Fantastic. Well, don't miss can I Comic <laughs> Timmy Pescarelli. You can take it at the <laughs> Pittsburgh Improv tonight through Saturday. Call the box office or go online for tickets. But hurry, as we mentioned, some sh shows are already sold out. Plans aren't available for no. everybody. <laughs> <laughs> only right. for celebrities. Yes, yeah, only for celebrities. We're going to be right back with a look at this week. When we say that's a wrap after this break. Thanks for being with us.